Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to make zoom through will transition effect easy in After Effects, let's begin. First of all scroll to the end of your will clip and then go 60 frames backward, hold shift and press page up 6 times. Now move your second clip below will layer like that and then make sure to select will layer and split in two pieces. We will need only that second part of a will layer and we have two options to make will zoom in transition. We can use it and leave it as a video, or we can freeze that layer and make things a lot easier. It will be easier because we won't need to track the mask after we mask out the wheel, but if we leave that second part as a video, we will need to mask and then track that mask as well. Let's do it on easy, make sure you are at the beginning of that second piece, then right click on it, go to time and select freeze frame. So first video goes normally and then it will be a still image. And now we can mask out the wheel. To mask I will use Mocha AE. In your case you can use any masking tools. In Mocha, I will select an ellipse tool and mask the wheel as smooth as possible. Once it's cool, we can save it and then close Mocha AE. Now let's expand matte and then click on create AE masks. Let's duplicate that layer and I will rename top one to zoom and then press M on a keyboard and change mask mode to subtract. Then select bottom layer and rename it to wheel only. I will toggle off wheel only layer for a while cause we don't need to see it yet. Let's scroll to the beginning of a zoom layer now and then create new camera layer. Change type to 2 node camera and preset to 35mm and then hit OK. Cut camera layer and match its zoom layer's length. Now move it above zoom and will layers and then highlight both layers and enable 3D on them. Now expand camera layers transform settings and click on point of interest and position stopwatch icons to create keyframes. Let's press U on a keyboard so we can see only created keyframes. Now go to the very end of a camera layer and then select a dolly cursor tool. Press C on a keyboard until you see it, where you can also select Dolly tool from a camera tools here. So once you have selected, make sure to zoom all the way in like that. Now select both keyframes and press F9 on a keyboard to easy ease them, then go to graph editor, right click here and select edit speed graph and then make a smooth curve. Let's close graph editor and check the effect. Nice, scroll to the beginning of a camera layer and then we can toggle on will layer and animate it as well. While will layer is selected, Press P on a keyboard and then click on position stopwatch icon, then scroll forward something like this and move position all the way down. Select both position keyframes and hit F9 on a keyboard to easy ease them. Looks fine, but I think it will look better if we make a smooth curve in a graph editor. Looks better, just make sure to enable motion blur on zoom and wheel layers and we're done with the transition. To make things a lot better, I will add shake effects. I will skip shakes part because I have made too much shake tutorials, also I have made 16 unique shake presets that you can get from the link in description, check how it looks like with my shake presets. Hope this video was helpful, thanks for watching and like the video please.